Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Asus Zenfone 9 and let me share with you how to change this navigation type with the buttons to the gestures. So first of all, let's enter the settings and here we have to scroll in order to find the display. Let's tap on it. Now let's scroll down again to the system bars and as you can see right here we've got the system navigation. So this is the option we're looking for. Let's enter. And as you can see at the very top we've got the animation of how to use particular mode it will be displayed not only for the navigation bar which we've got currently set but also for the gesture navigation mm, but let me first of all before we will set the gestures uh, let me focus uh, on the navigation bar just for a second uh, so if you'd like to stick with this option if you'd like to have those three buttons navigation you can customize it if you want to you can just tap on the settings icon and as you can see you can uh, first of all change the button layout so we can simply re order the recent and the back button it's of course up to you and here you can decide what you want to do with the recent app scheme so we can tap and hold to take the screenshot or you can always show recent apps let me just get back it was just a quick disclaimer for those of you who would like to uh, stick with the three buttons navigation but let me get back and let's finally change the uh, change it to the gestures so basically all we have to do is to simply tap on this option at the top and as you can see uh, this animation changed uh, of course it will show us uh, how to use the gestures um, of course I'll show you also uh, so let's begin with the customization of the gestures. Let's again tap on this uh, settings icon and here we've got uh, the digital assistant and also the bug sensitivity. So here you can decide if you want to uh, swipe to invoke the assistant. It's of course up to you. You can keep it turned on or off. Um, I will turn it off. Mm, and here we've got the back sensitivity, which simply means that we can change the area which will be responsible for catching our back gesture. So uh, by uh, setting the high option, this um, blue stripe on the left will be wider. By going uh, to the left uh, side with this, um, with this switcher, you can see that this blue area is much, much smaller. It's up to you. I will leave it uh, like a default, but of course you can set it just like you want. So now let me um, explain how the gestures work. It's quite easy and uh, quite comfortable after using it for a while. So if you'd like to get back to the previous page, um, just like by using the back button, all you have to do is to simply swipe your finger from the side to the center of your device until you will see this, um, this arrow. After that, you can release the finger. And as you can see, we just got back to the system navigation. So the previous page. And here it doesn't really matter if you will do it from the left side or the right side because it works the same so uh, if you'd like to get back to the home page then all you have to do is to simply swipe your finger up fastly from the bottom to the center of your device just like that and as you can see we are in the home page if you'd like to open the recents you have to do the same motion but do it a little bit slower and hold your finger somewhere here just like that and after releasing you can see that here we've got the recents so basically that's all this is how to set the gestures in your asus zenfone 9 thank you so much for watching i hope that this video was helpful and if it was please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up